Hey everyone, I just did another video where I did a walkthrough of this, if you want to check it out. But I said in that video that I wanted to do a quick film update of my space here that I'm updating. Um, this is the cat bed that I have set up for Min Min, who likes to sleep in here on the couch that I have. So this is like my home library space, but it's going to be converted... I mean, it's still going to be my library space because I still plan to keep those shelves up and these shelves, but I'm going to get some different kinds of, um, some bookends, some different kinds of bookends to be able to stand these up because my cat likes to try and lay on them. Um, and I have to get some really sturdy ones because they're like big, thick books. Um, but that's like my little book corner. <laughs> And you can see the boxes I took out. Those came from underneath my bookshelf that's over here. So I've been cleaning that up. I have some stuff I store down here. That brown box has Cricut stuff, uh, part of the Cricut bundle I ordered. That's a Teresa Collins box that I ended up sending the package back because <laughs> um, I didn't really like the box or I didn't like what was inside of it. But um, or actually, no, I couldn't send it back because the shipping was really expensive. Anyway, I put a bunch of uh, papers in there that I have, like um, like the cardstock papers. And then that's a easel I have for painting. So this is like my couch. This is the couch I used to have in my living room when I lived in uh, Virginia. And I thought it fit in pretty good. Here, so back here I've just got some stuff for that I've been pulling out. That I need to break down. I'm organizing. So this is one of my boxes. This is my miscellaneous box. This is a happy planner box. This is my simply gilded box so far, which I have a lot more still. <laughs> and then this is my Archer and Olive box so far. And I have a lot of stuff downstairs too, y'all, so this isn't anywhere near how much I have. This is a Planners Anonymous box I filled out. These are some pens I need to test that I was going to do a video for. I'm putting boxes in here, or cards in here that I come across, like different kinds of decorative cards and whatnot. I think the tissue box is self-explanatory. Uh, these are a bunch of sticker books and then literal sticker books. I bought some of that special HP paper that I haven't tried it yet. Man, what are you doing? Ugh, he's going nuts. Bunch of sticker books, and this has like just a bunch of random stuff in it. A lot of this stuff has random stuff in it. This is part of the reorganization too, is figuring that stuff out. I have a Villa Beautiful box that I started. This has a bunch of journals and stuff in it. Little notebooks and all that. I have a cup there that has bookmarks in it um this has pens in it hold on i gotta see what my cat's doing all right this is where i was i got that cute clock up there cat clock this is my cat that's missing his name's atticus i got some other cat pictures back there like i said Everything is going to be moved around and changed. I just wanted to show you guys what it looks like right now. I got to put this calendar up. I had it on the wall over here, but there's not room now with the bookcase right there. And then I have that. It's really pretty. That's for 2021, but I still think it's pretty. I got, So I got a bunch of butterfly stuff right there. And then I got a bunch more books. Um, put together that tray. I got a whole bunch of stuff under there that I gotta clean out. I got a bunch of stuff in these drawers that I gotta clean out. I just, a bunch of random stuff, more books. This has my cat, Ralphie, always in forever. That's a picture of him. That was my dog, Harley. Um, I don't know if you see, I cleaned out one of the cubby spaces that had Archer and Olive in it, so I gotta clean out that one with the Archer and Olive stuff I have. I have more Archer and Olive downstairs. I got all this stuff here that I gotta clean out. Um, and then I'm gonna clean out my craft cart too and redo that. 
You can see I got pens and stuff down there. And then I had these on the desk, but I didn't know if they'd get in the way while I was filming, so I just moved them over here for now. I'm thinking of, I might actually move that stuff over here. And then this over here, and this area is going to be like a staging area for me filming over here on my desk. So I don't know if I'll get like a tray to put the stuff in, like the stickers I'm going to use, and then have a tray for the planner or something big enough to put everything in, or just leave it like this. But I thought that was kind of a good idea to have like a little staging area. And then, you know, have stuff down here that I can use too, that I can utilize. As you can see, I have a thing for teal, so I have the lights. These lights actually change color if I want them to, but I just leave them with the teal color. And then I have a thing for Christmas ornaments, especially teal ones, <laughs> if you can't tell. So I just hung them all up so I never have to take them down. And here's this amazing chair that I ordered from Wayfair. It is super comfortable. I love it. It works so good. I've sat in it for quite a while and had no problems. Here's my new desk that I got for my birthday. Look how beautiful this is. Oh, you know, and I didn't even realize, oh my gosh, look how far that goes back. <gasps> I didn't even realize that. So I haven't even put anything in here yet. Oh, and check this out. So not only is this a drawer I can use, but it folds down. So I can use it as a tray for, um, for a keyboard or whatever. And they like snap. See how that like, watch like snaps seals into the place and this hardware oh my gosh it's so nice and for some reason the box that i posted a picture of oh it's just a file hanging drawer i probably won't use it that way oh oh nice i just duh all right so i removed it so i don't even have to use that at all um what's i saying oh on the box it said it was a three drawer pedestal desk and I think they must have used the wrong box or something because I technically have six drawers which is amazing I mean I guess maybe they don't consider this a drawer but I do because if I don't fold it down you know so like stuff like that I might move into the desk but for now it was just easier to put it in the tray and then this is a pretty little rug I had in here and I brought the couch here for like sitting here to read. And then here is um, Sonos speaker, really, really good. My Canon selfie, my Cricut I've never used, my HP printer that I'm gonna be trying to use to make stickers, silhouette. And then this is my laptop. And um, this is the labels that I'm using four sticker paper. Oh, and I, so this is my lighting setup right now, by the way. I have that light up there. And then I have some lights across the room, but uh, I showed this. My video just cut out on me. I don't know why. Um, we're going to be making different kinds of wood and using this space. It's going to be like, it's going to be like this, like pieces of wood coming out from the wall. Not, they don't look like this, but pieces of wood staggered in different sizes and lengths, and I'm going to put washi on them. So they're going to be like washi, like instead of a coat rack, it's going to be like a washi rack. So I'll probably do that above the bookcase here, since there's not a lot of room there anyway. And then I'm going to decorate all this. And actually my plan is to get a neon light sign that says creatively Lisa Marie going across here that's my goal that's what I'd like to do um there's my coffee cup from my last video so yeah this is what it looks like so far I thought it might be easier to do a walkthrough in a video for you guys so you could see what I'm working with and putting together I'm lucky that the ceilings are real high here and I'm only five two so there's plenty of space. My new desk is amazing. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if you have any questions or if you have any suggestions for what I'm doing here for storage or anything. And um, I hope you guys are staying safe 
and I will see you and talk to you in my next video. Bye.